This is Lauren Schoenberg coming to you in the summer of 2021. Let's get one thing clear here as it relates to fake news, and that is that the recording you're about to hear never happened in its totality. We have merged together a 1933 version of Yeah Man, as played by the Fletcher Henderson Band, and the same tune played five years later by the Count Basie Band. And the rationale for this uh, kind of Frankensteinish version is that when Lester Young took Coleman Hawkins' place in the Fletcher Henderson Band in 1934, it's fair to assume that they played this arrangement, but there are no recordings of Lester Young with Fletcher Henderson, a great missed opportunity. We don't get to hear Lester on record until two years later when, in November 1936, at the age of 28, he recorded his first uh, records. So, what we hear is the Fletcher Henderson Band in 1933, one of their two versions of Yeah Man, and then you'll hear Lester Young, and those items are from the Count Basie performance, and then we go back and forth one more time, kind of in an imaginary session, where Lester and Coleman Hawkins were playing together in the 1930s on the same song. I think it's kind of interesting, and uh, for those of us that have been kind of obsessed with wondering what Lester might have sounded like with the Fletcher Henderson Band, this might be as close as we can get to realizing that dream. And I should also mention that the wonderful clarinet solo on the Henderson version is by Russell Prokope. The long trumpet solo is by Bobby Stark. And later on, there's a little glimpse of Henry Red Allen. <laughs> Thank you. 